Chanbury has slight rise to 89 confirmed new infections of COVID-19 this morning in the province. Good morning, everyone. I'm Adam, and you are listening to TPN Media here in Pattaya. Thank you for tuning in. This morning, the Department of Public Health announced 89 new and confirmed cases of COVID-19 today, May 7th, which is a slight rise from yesterday. This makes a total of over 3,000 cases of COVID-19 in the current route of infections that started in April. However, on the bright side, 1,549 people in total have been released from medical care and fully recovered. 115 people alone were released yesterday. Now, in terms of where the most cases are coming from, that is still Bangla Moon, which is where Patia is located, as a lot of people and our listeners are not familiar with Bangla Moon, but are familiar with Pattaya, which is over a thousand cases, 1,360 to be exact, from the Bangla Moon area. Yesterday, 38 new cases came from Bangla Moon. Almost all of the new cases are coming from confirmed close contacts of previous patients, especially families or people gathering in and around home. This is not surprising, being that dining is closed and the city's thousands of entertainment venues, bars, nightclubs, etc. have been shuttered for almost a month. So now, where the spread is coming from, according to the Department of Public Health, is people having private gatherings. That's why earlier this week, Chambury Governor went ahead and issued a request that condos, apartment buildings, rooming houses, dormitories, and similar establishments have their landlords and people that run the buildings assist them with stopping social gatherings outside of people's own families. Uh, The government says that they understand how difficult this is for people, especially Thai people who enjoy barbecues and drinking and socializing, but they simply must try to get this under control right now. And unfortunately, although the situation has slightly improved, it's still not where it needs to be. They are still testing roughly about 2,000 people a day, uh, primarily in and around factories and workplaces and people that work in high-risk occupations. What a high-risk occupation is to the Department of Public Health is people that are still having uh, strong work done with the public, like taxi drivers or supermarkets, uh, things along those lines that are still having daily interactions. Now, Specifically, the Department of Public Health is asking people to stay home if at all possible, work from home if possible, um, to go ahead and get the situation resolved. Like we said in other videos, checkpoints are gone. You don't need documentation. We want to keep making that clear to leave the province, but you should stay at home according to the Department of Public Health. Thank you for watching.